cooking show. This is a takeoff from another show I have called Effin' Cooking with Bob, minus the vulgar language. Okay, let's get started today. What are we going to do for you? We're going to make today a beautiful dish. It's a chicken and apple walnut with brown sugar sauce topped with coconut. <laughs> Does it get better? Of course it gets better. Okay? We've got nice couscous served with that. Whole wheat, of course, because we don't mess around here. And, uh... I mean, you might throw in something else, something special, you know, maybe some topped uh, olive oil with some cucumbers. It'd probably dress up the plate to look good as well. Anyways, let's get cooking with Bob. The finer things in life. Happily, some are affordable, like Grey Poupon Dijon mustard. Grey Poupon is so fine, it's even made with white wine. Its original French Dijon recipe adds distinctive flavor to beef, pork, and poultry, salad dressing and sauces, and of course, sandwiches. So enjoy one of life's finer pleasures. Pardon me, would you have any Grey Poupon? But of course. Grey Poupon, one of life's finer pleasures. Okay, welcome back to Rob and Rob, uh, a.k.a. Effin' Cooking with Bob. We don't need to bring that up anymore, but I just did, so let's move on. Okay, there's going to be no cooking, no chopping today. Okay, usually I cook and chop like a maniac. Watch me go. But anyways, today we're just going to, we're going to get right to the basics. I got water already boiling over here. We're going to start off with the couscous, whole wheat, baby. you got to love it. Okay, what you need to do, you get your water boiling. Couscous is a beautiful thing, okay? Half a tablespoon of salt, bam! Goes right in there, okay? Two tablespoons, all oil, try not to use, I don't like to use butter. Not on the two screws, okay? You think I'm crazy? <laughs> Should taste this. Unbelievable. All right, so there we go. We got the water boiling. You know, we're going to take it off because that's what you do. We're going to add in couscous. Make sure you stir it around and fluff it, okay? That's all you got to do. It's easy, simple, it's healthy. You know, I can't ask for much more than that. All right, so there you go. You got the little fluff up there. Boom. We're going to cover that. Put that on for five minutes. Fluff it up, it's done, okay? We'll be right back. We're going to come back and we're going to do the brown sugar sauce. All right? Talk to you soon. Cook it with all. Remember that. Place to be stingy. Pizza's four ninety five online. Okay, welcome back to Robbie Rob, aka Cooking with Bob. Uh, we're gonna do the brown sugar sauce now. Couscous is done, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna take out. We're gonna have a cup and a half of hot water. Okay, we're gonna put a Put our heat on medium, we're going to bring out the cup and a half of water. To start off this little dish, we also use Teflon. <whistles> Hands down the best stuff around. Okay, so here we go. we got a cup and a half of hot water. Look at that. They spill a drop. One take. We ain't doing no mixing over here, baby. You know you lost me on the screen, that's all right. How to get rid of the hot stuff, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to add in four tablespoons of butter. I cheated though because I use margarine. Bam, that goes over there. Okay, next thing we're going to do, we're going to add in all the ingredients, okay? So we're going to come in, a cup of brown sugar. There. Oh, gotta love it. 
It's it's not it's not stop up. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, add in tablespoon of cornstarch. Oh, this is gonna be beautiful. I can't wait to see this. And we're gonna put in a dash of salt. I'm not really big on the salt. The ingredients call for it, so we're gonna use it. All right, so there's your dash. Dash of do. We don't like to make a mess over here, so we clean as we go. The last little ingredient over here. Did I have that open the whole time? Anyway. Last ingredient you want to use is the uh, pure vanilla syrup. All right? So let's get this thing going. Let's mix it up. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to mix this all up. Okay? So all the ingredients are melted down nice. And you're going to pull it off. Off the heat. Then you add in the vanilla. Pure vanilla extract. What I said, shut before. It's all good. Oh, this looks great. This is a beautiful thing going on over here. All right. Okay, the margarine, butter, whatever's in there, it's probably margarine. I don't think we use butter in this house. Probably should know my ingredients, but you know what? You use what you like, so I gave you an option. How's that? Most people don't give you an option. I just gave you one. All right. Here we go. Coming around one time. Butter's almost done. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. All right, we're going to shut our heat down. We're going to come off. I usually like to wait a little bit. Keep stirring it, though. You don't want that sugar to settle. And by the way, it's a light brown sugar. Another option. If you want to use the brown sugar, use the brown sugar. I like the light brown sugar. All right? If you want to go organic, go organic. Whatever you like to use for ingredients, they'll be popping up on the screen as we go. They usually do on my show. I like to uh, also leave a little recipe at the end so that you can, uh, you know, maybe make this at home for loved ones. All right, enough of that. We're all done. We're gonna add in that. That's just gonna sweeten it up. That is going to sweeten it up. Oh, look at that. This is going to be delicious. Oh, man. All right. Good to go. We cover it up. And that's it. We'll be right back with the main dish, the apples, the chicken, the walnuts. We're going to slam that stuff all in there, put some coconut on top. We'll be right back. Coconut and